Hey guys, it's me, Kaluna Sims. We're here with a build tour of my build, classic New England home. And as the title suggests, this is a family home that looks like a classic house you would find in New England. Who would have guessed? Um, as you can see, there's lots of flowers outside, lots of details in terms of window boxes and wreaths, just lots of little decorative items to make the yard look pretty. And as we enter, there's a nice big foyer in here. You have your thermostat to the side. You have your pet um, hanging stuff, your clothes hanging stuff, your shoe rack <laughs> off to the right there. And off to the left here, we have a big formal dining room which is just traditional enough to keep it cozy looking as well. Off to the right here, we're going to open up into an office with all these big bookshelves, a computer desk, and a nice little art easel for any artists in the family. Then of course it opens up to the big family space. I'm not a fan of open floor plans, but in this house it just works. So we have this big kitchen over here with an island counter to eat at for breakfast, but also it has a breakfast nook in the corner with an actual table. And then off to the side here we have of course the living area for seating and a big TV. And then a full bathroom down here, no bathtub, but it has a shower, a sink, and a toilet, which is more than enough for a guest bathroom. And I think I'm going to show you the back porch before we go upstairs, which is not usually how I do these build tours, but apparently that's how I felt like doing it then. You, of course, have your grill and your drinks pitcher outside because everybody knows summertime's the only good time to be in New England. That's not true. I love New England. I live here. Um, but we all love a good barbecue in the summer, okay? Um, you have garden pots out back. You have a clothesline. You have a fire pit. You know, all the outdoor activities you would do. And... Now we're going to go upstairs very slowly because this camera likes to go very slow. Here we go. Up the stairs. Oh my god, that's about as fast as I get upstairs because I'm elderly. Here's a big fish tank on the landing because it seemed like a nice little touch to add. And then through here is the main bedroom. You walk in, there's a screen divider there to break up the view of the bed, but there's a big bed, a rocking chair, and a cat tree for your cat because, I don't know, I have cats, so everybody has to have cats now. That's just the rule. There's also this big ensuite over here. There's a bathtub, a shower, a toilet, and a double sink, um, except the sinks seem to have uh, vanished, which, that's cool. Thanks for that, Sims. And the walk-in closet back here. <laughs> Um, so if you download this, you'll have to add sinks to the master bathroom because they disappeared at some point, which is just my favorite thing The Sims does, but I apologize for that. Um, <laughs> and then we're going to go to the next room over, which is the laundry room. You have plenty of room to fold up your laundry and hang anything that needs to be hung up. Full laundry room. And next to that is a guest bedroom. So you have a single bed in here. Um, a, the dog bed or, or a cat bed and in the closet there is actually a, where I stuck the desk which seemed like a nice place to put it and the dresser's out here but of course you could change that around and make that a lofted bed if you wish but the bedroom's not that big this is the shared bathroom on this floor you have bathtub combo toilet and sinks of course and then the other room which is almost a mirror of that first room except this bed is lofted above a toddler bed in case you have a toddler and there are a lot more toys in here because this is geared at children rather than the other one, which was geared at a teenager. All right, and we're going back down the stairs real slow. I can hear this person's bones creaking. And I'm definitely projecting because it's going to be my bones that are creaking if I'm going down these stairs. It's the life of an old person, you know? And just be like that. <laughs> But anyway, this is the entire build. It is down uploaded on my gallery called Classic New England Home, and I will put the gallery name in the description below. Like, comment, and subscribe if you feel like it, or leave any other feedback. And I hope you download and enjoy this build, which does have a roof. It just didn't show up in this view. Um, but thanks so much for watching. Bye!